Hello lovelies! So today I'm going to do a video, a Q and A video. I asked all my friends on Facebook if they would give me some questions to answer. And I got quite a few. I have my laptop here with all my Facebook and I'm just going to read them all. So the first question I was asked was from Esme Hill who is a fellow YouTuber. Uh, she asked who is your current favourite YouTuber and what's your favourite brand of makeup or lipsticks? My favourite YouTuber at the minute is Nikki Tutorials because she's just amazing. She, she's all I watch. Um, there is no one better than Nikki Tutorials. She's cool. And as for what's my favourite makeup brand for lipsticks, I would say Colourpop. I know they're liquid lipsticks but Actual lipsticks, I would. Oh, I'd say MAC, but mm, it's only because it's only I really use. Other than that, I don't use lipsticks much, to be honest. The next question is from my friend Chloe, and she says, Favourite memory from school and why? Um, I have a lot of favourite memories from school. I don't, I don't really have one. I have a lot. I could I'll tell you my favourite year at school. My favourite year at school was year 11. It gave me the best memories. I had the best group of friends. And it was just the best. And I was having so much fun. Getting drunk. Not going to lessons and stuff. I never should have done. But I um, did pretty okay in my exam. So that doesn't reflect much. So yeah. Just, I don't have a favourite memory. There's a lot of funny, funny, funny memories from school. The next question is also from a fellow YouTuber and one of my very, very, very good friends, Chloe Jade. Uh, she says, what place in the world would you like to visit and why? I would like to visit Paris, city of romance, or 52 states in America, just for the pure fact that that would be fucking amazing. Switzerland again, because it's just the most beautiful place in the world. I would also like to go to... I'd love, love, love to go to places like the Maldives, Bora Bora, Dubai, you know, in that kind of region, Jamaica, where they have the beautiful white sand and the bright blue beach and all that stuff. Blue, 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 bright blue seas. Oh, it's really beautiful. The next question from another YouTuber that I know from Kitty is what's your dream job i would like to be uh i'd either um i'd like to be on a cruise ship i'd like to work in disney or disney cruise that would tell us who's going i'd like to be on west end i'd like to be a makeup artist i'd like to be a photographer anything that's not doesn't require being athletic or smart I could probably do because I don't need those things. Next question is from Liam Byford. I love you, Liam Byford. He said, What have you got planned for the summer that you can't wait for with a winky face emoji? The reason he's asking this is because me, him, and two of my other friends are going to go to V Festival this year. We're doing the weekend camping, and that is going to be amazing. That's in August. Also, me, him, and another friend, the same friend from who we're going to be with, Amy. Uh, we are going to Wales for the weekend in July. I'm going to just get really drunk and just have a whale of a time. Ah, Wales. Well, Wales. Uh, yeah, it's going to be fun. Question from Franny Shepherd it says Advice to people doing GCSEs. Uh, being totally honest, I only passed like 6 out of the 11 GCSEs that I did, which is okay, but I've rather got 11. But to be honest, I would just say revise a lot. Try and do things that help make revision easier, like uh, sticky notes in places that you visit frequently in the house, or like, um, I don't know, I didn't revise much. That's why I'm saying revise, because I didn't revise and I got six GCSE. So I assume if you revise, you will get more. All my friends that revised got a lot of GCSEs. So yeah, just a lot of revision. 
don't go overboard with it, but take it easy. Do it, do it. Emily Lowell asks, um, what's your favourite makeup brand and why? Drugstore and high end. High end, Morphe, because of the fact that it is got so many amazing products. Or Urban Decay, I do like Urban Decay, but they test on animals. So. Correct me if I'm wrong actually, do they test on animals? I'm pretty sure I saw a video on YouTube of a girl saying that they, they do test on animals. Or their mother corporation tests on animals, so they fund for testing animals. I don't know. But yeah, Morphe probably. Drugstore, I would say uh, 17. I do like me some 17 stuff. Hmm. Demi Harvey asks, best friend ever and why? Charl Hill asks, do you prefer doing makeup on others or yourself? Myself, because if I cock it up, then I can just, now I can see, and I can still look good. And no one knows that I'm making this stuff. She also asks, your favourite part of my makeup and your least favourite? Favourite part is eyeshadow, because it's so, it feels so good to just see it blend out and oh, create such a beautiful my least favourite part is probably eyelashes. Yes, I do have an eyelash shunt to do. But they are really annoying. They didn't go anywhere. It was, uh, well, I love them, but they're really hard to apply sometimes. And contouring, contouring is sometimes hard. But I'm just sorry. Lines on your face. The last question that I have is from Lily Jackson. And she asks Most embarrassing drunken moment. <laughs> Okay, so here's the story. One time I was about 13 years old and I went out and got really drunk. So I told them that I was at this house and um, I was actually out in the streets drinking three litres of Frosty Jacks as that was the thing back when I was 13 years old. And then um, I, we were, we were by a little river, the brook, and I was spinning with my bottle as such, spinning round as that apparently makes you get drunk faster, whatever. And I fell in the brook. I fell like this with my arm in the brook, one arm up here in the mud, all the mud was up here and it was a slant and I was just like that this for a while. So one of my friends came and rescued uh, Demi actually came and sorted me out. I was really, really, really drunk, really disgusting, and I got. She took my jacket for me and cleaned it and cleaned me up. So thanks for that, Demi. I'll never forget that one. So yeah, that was all the questions that you guys asked me. If you like me doing Q and A's, please let me know because I don't know what you like to see. I love doing Q and A's, but if you don't like, it, then just let me know. Actually, if you don't. Like Anyways. Uh, thank you for all the questions. Thank you to everyone who's watched this video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will try and upload more frequently with more impact. So yeah, uh, I will see you.